Hello, my name is Gabriela Garzón at Gigi Image and Erika Consulting in Miami, Florida. To become a fashion consultant, you need to be very unique. You need to be an original person that will come up with different combinations and things on your own. So in my case, uh, I decided to become a fashion consultant because I would always get compliments on how I would put things together and how I would wear things that I had for years and I would just make them practically new with just a couple of accessories and a different way of wearing the same skirt or the same dress. So you have to be very um, original on your ideas and come up on the go with different things to actually do with the same clothing. So once I started realizing that I had that, um, I don't know what to call it, I don't know, that sense, that special gift or whatever, aside of the fact that I love fashion, then I realized that a lot of people were asking me for advice. And then I said, well, if I'm good at this, I might as well do some research and start um, taking classes or just be certified. So that's exactly what I did. Aside of being a subscriber for different fashion magazines and of course going to fashion shows and watching a lot of TV that has to do with fashion advices and everything. Um, I don't necessarily agree with everything that's out there, but that's like I said, that's why you need to know how your, um, how your fashion sense actually kicks in because you need to know what actually works or does not work to your client. This is not only about yourself. If you're really good dressing up, okay, fine. But you need to find out if you're really good at actually seeing what's good on other people, not just yourself. Because what looks good on me will not look good in certain clients that I have. But once you see a person, you need to know, oh, well, if this person changes this, this, and this, it will look better like this or like that. So you need to have that little um, gift to actually see what looks good on other people.